to win each game is I don't even know what they're playing so well. Good. I'll tell you, looking at this, the Gibblers, yeah, it might be great. They're sitting back in net. They've got eight saves. Uh, no, not to you know, not to forget, Prairie Dogs had to make five. But you know, we often yeah. talk about that. Saves aren't a great stat. If you're making saves, it means you're losing shots. They got outshot eleven to six That's in true. this one. Uh, so they have to make all these big saves. And, and I, I noticed that halfway through the match, uh, the Gibblers were making some fantastic saves. They're getting some big clears, but they're not chasing those clears down and getting a lot of offensive time and possession as a result. They get the big boomer clear. They're getting into the zone, but they're giving it away when they get it there. So I'd almost like to see them here get the clear they need, but get up there, catch it, slow it down a little bit, set up a play a little bit, because Prairie Dogs are doing an absolute dynamite job of getting high in those walls and digging into those corners and clearing those boomers that came down into their zone. So, you know, throwing yeah, those throwing grenades and Prairie Dogs picking them up and throwing them right back. They need to find a way to slow this down, channel that ball to the middle a little bit and get some quality shots uh, to, to show for all the, you know, get off of those saves, turn some of those saves into quality shots. Yep, I agree, absolutely. They need a nice sequence, just like you said, turning those saves into shots. They were just kind of shooting it out there hoping for the best and it didn't really work out for them so they yeah they just need to to slow the the game down as you said and uh and control the ball a little bit better all right let's get these guys we're all set for game three one to one is the split right now and yeah, see if they can if they're picking up on the same thing that we did as we get into this one here love to see uh a little more from Shiny this match, dude. Nice. He hasn't played a poor game whatsoever. Don't uh, don't get me wrong, but uh, certainly capable of pushing a little bit more. I expect to see him step up in this match here. I'm going to call that uh, an MVP <laughs> Shiny here in, here in uh, game three. Here we go. Toast versus Prairie, and Gibbler's gain the zone. Now, nope, now it's going to come back. Dogs fighting off in the corner. Uh, trying to get a little pressure. Prayer Rangers up and a nice redirect. Wow, and that's going to be a shot. And Shiny makes a save he did not think he had to make. And an, Whoa, Oh, wow. that would touch light. Did you see that? that was that's fantastic. one of the best shots I've seen Prairie Ranger make. That was a fantastic off-the-wall shot. Fantastic. Wow. Well done, buddy. Yeah, agreed. And, uh, I mean, uh, amazing shot, but uh, I really liked Trentino's read on the play. Mm. As it was going in, he's able to... Uh, I think it was the same one that you're talking about. Good goal right there, too. I'll just be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, this is your time. <laughs> no, yeah, good push there. Good read by Atmos that came off the ceiling. Exactly. Nice pin goal there. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, pin shot, I guess, if you can call it. <laughs> and no, back well, to the... Well played by them. <clears throat> oh, no, you oh, hate whoa. to see it, but... <laughs> You hate to see it unless you're a Kimmy Gibbler 3.0. <laughs> and that shot that As Atmo took that beat them dead to rights gets repaid with a office blunder on the faceoff here. Yeah, that's something you don't see very often from the uh, from the dog from the prairie dogs at all. Yeah, call it's it out. On the face -off. Call it out, draws, draws, do something, anything. But someone's gotta go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And here comes Trantino, gonna push this. Hard towards the net, and that gets clear. Toast with a challenge on Age Unicorn. Good 50 there. And that one comes back the other way. Shiny for redirects. Got Trent in the middle. And that's going to go up. Not quite. It's going to be on the short side. He redirects. Prairie Ranger with a great read there, and this one's coming back. Yeah, Prairie Dogs really kind of got to get a little bit careful with the, with the doubling on the defensive shots right now, although Kimmy Gibbler's not really making them pay for it too much. They're really focusing on picking up those big pads. Yeah, that's another thing maybe we could see out of the Gibblers. A lot more, yeah. I mean, uh, pardon me, a lot more shots probably if that if they can focus a little bit less on the big ones. Pick up some of them pennies and just get to that net for a shot. Toast is going to track this down. Shiny's going to put this back. He's got Trentino in the middle. Oh, oh and he just overran that. Did he Did he go over that? Or did that he he, he that went time? over it, yeah. yeah. Just a little tiny bit. Yeah, not something we see out of him all that often. Good well, challenge right. there. This one's a pop. A good effort, fly. but he needs to. He definitely needs to get those shots on that. Good effort, but needs a little bit more than that. One guy to beat and can't. Atmo sails this out. Trentino's going to bring it back the other way, and a good step up by Unicorn, who had three in the zone versus one. He gets a nice push and a little bit of showboating going on there with one one. Probably squanders a play out of it. <laughs> I mean, sometimes though. 
I mean, that can throw you when you see a guy going up doing that, wondering where you're going with it. So, to his credit, yeah, it makes I mean, it does probably it work. Guess. Yeah. Off and the wall here, Shiny Antos doubling in on pressure there. Trying to corral this again as Toast got two to beat and can't. Trentino on the wall, keeping this play alive. Doesn't have a whole lot of boost to follow up. We find Toast all alone. Atmos trying to work the high wall. Both of these teams doing a fantastic job of not letting anything come up, come out front, not off the backboard, not off the corners. Yep, exactly. Again, playing, you know, this is, hasn't been uh, as much of a, I don't know, if, <laughs> I don't know what to call it, but, uh, you know, not as many shots on net, saves, no. more of a neutral zone kind of game. Sure, but, it was uh, a shooting gallery game one and two, and this one's been a lot more subdued. Yeah, but uh, exactly. no less impressive. Oh, and there's a shot there that's going to bounce. Oh, my goodness. Whoa, and Toast man. goes up and puts it off the crossbar on purpose. And a nice save there. I mean, he uh, just fell right down beside him. He probably thought, oh, no, please. You know, if I'm him, I I think this is what he did. He probably stopped moving thinking, my buddy's going to pop this in. I don't want to get in the way. Yeah, exactly. You don't want to take it away from your buddy. Except it was <laughs> Toast that showed up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're kicking yourself. That still remains 1-1. What a great match coming into a final minute. Shiny trying to get a push there and can't. Toast cycles back around the back post. Trentino trying to get the, uh, well, he's the reverse challenge there. Berry Ranger all the way back and off the post there. Oh, that goes on the second post and remains 1-1. One one. It's Unicorn high in the corner. He's got someone open. He's putting it over to center and Toast reads that play. Atmos got a great shot but a good save. And a bounce here as everyone regroups, sets up defensively. And Kimmy Gibblers go for some boost. This one's get pushed into the zone, and Unicorn has to come back to make a defensive clear. Challenged by Toast and back out to center. Prairie Range, oh, Prairie Dogs, mind you, going to push this out. And a good opportunity as a blunder made by Toast is going to go straight at the net, and Trentino Whoa. makes a save he didn't expect. Wow. Oh, oh that's a decent demo. Decent demo. A good demo. Shiny on Atmos there. Trying to open up some space and knocks off the bar. Trentino patient with this one. Like to see that. Wasn't sure who was coming in. Prairie Ranger was on the doorstep oh. and a big save there as Unicorn thought he had it. He had his arms in the air. <laughs> My goodness. After all of this. And, oh, man. and we are going to overtime in game three. Wow. Man, they really poured it on there so much at the end. I can't believe it stayed out. Did wow. you see that face-off? You don't often see a double-side face-off like that. Oh, Shiny and Unicorn were both on the <laughs> on the uh, north side and both took the face-off. It's kind of cool to see. I wonder if it shocked them as much as us. <laughs> Great series so far. This is nice yeah, and tight. This is wonderful. A bounce off the buckle, well read by Toast. That's actually harder to make than you think. And Prairie Ranger tracks that well. Trentino has an opportunity for shot. Whoa. And again, Ranger, who's playing one of the best games I've seen all season. Shiny with the redirect. One, two chances at it. And finally, the dogs get a clear. And slowing it down to corral it. He beats one. He's not going to beat Shiny, and he knows it, and half flips back. Atmos in the corner, trying to challenge. And Prairie Ranger had to come up with another save there. It's Unicorn smelling blood. He's in on toast. Gonna try and put it high, and he does. Atmos is up for the shot. Wow, oh, that was a wide what a one. save. Prairie Ranger bounce off redirect. Nobody there. I think they were back trying to get some boost, although Age Unicorn's gonna try and slowly make a flick here. Realizes nothing's gonna come of this and plays it off into the corner. And a shot there was wide. Atmos trying to keep it alive. Gibbler's all stacked up. And no one there for a shot from the dogs as that came out. Now we're going to come back the other way. 3v1 until some hustle back. It's just Age Unicorn. Surely they're back by now, and they are. Atmos on the streak on the far side. Unicorn trying to get it out to him and can't. Shiny going to try and drop this right now. And a chance? No. Toast. Boy, the defensive, defensive, defensive right now. Just stacked up inside the net. What do they got to do here? Do you get aggressive here? Do you, do you beat the first team to take that chance to stretch the field a little bit? I don't know if you'd really want to, because the yeah. way that both of these teams are is so back and forth right now. If you even step out of your net a little bit, something's gonna go in. So you gotta play aggressive yet at the same time so passive to stay in your net. Yeah, it feels so. like a game where they're waiting for the other team to make a bigger mistake than them. That's exactly <laughs> it. It's basically all you can do right now. But both teams, both teams are, are playing as much it well. Yeah. 
Not as much pepper on as they want. It's shiny slows it down, flicks over Prairie is. Ranger, Ooh. and Ancient Unicorn bails him out. Toes tie off the wall. This is going to drop shallow. Unicorn tries to redirect and leaves it for Atmos. And as he read that, not exactly how he would have liked. Good push by Shiny. Other Gibblers smelling blood out in center, but they don't get that opportunity as they got to cycle back and set up for T. Good half field redirect. Trentino's got an opportunity to send this the other way. And Unicorn with the challenge out to center and nobody there at all. Oh, that could have been a game there for a shot. And now Trentino is cycling back. There. Yeah, what was that? <clears throat> he definitely needed somebody mid. He was expecting mm -hmm. a teammate to be mid and that, that would have been a perfect play. But I think uh, both of them were a little bit low on boost, so they were just trying to catch up. And put into the zone. It's Shiny who's going to go up for his zone. He's got a chance for a redirect, and oh, i got to say, what? Wow. What just happened? I, I was going to say, I think Trentino just made his own save, but then he put it... What oh, my guy. goodness. What a goal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know wow. in columns, okay. too, that you know Shiny was going, what are you doing, Trent? Oh, never mind. <laughs> that was a fantastic slow mo read. Red Age Unicorn with a 240 ping. Hopefully, they can get that. It's already settling down a little bit now, but what a game! Boy, Kimmy Gibblers take a two to one lead with a fantastic effort there, really by the whole team all around. But a nice goal finish there by the captain Trentino. And they've got Prairie Do uh, the Prairie Dogs on their back. How do they get this done? Yeah. Oh. Uh, you know what? Honestly, they don't really need to change too much in their game. They had uh, just an unfortunate bounce there, a really 